These are the three most senior Democrats on the Judiciary Committee. These are our senators who today would be among the most conservative members of the Senate. They are bitter critics of the Warren Court and the Warren Court's key, uh, key decisions. And so essentially what they decide among themselves, and Eastland is the chair of the committee. The chair of the committee controls how the, the process operates. Again, think to the examples of the last few weeks, the key person in the Kavanaugh hearings was Chuck Grassley, the, the Republican chairman who, who uh, you know, sort of presided over the hearings. What Eastland, McClellan, and Irvin decide is that they are going to use this opportunity to put the Warren court on trial, to basically bring Abe Fortas before their committee and grill him on a variety of Warren court decisions. So instead of a routine hearing, what Fortas gets is very detailed questions about specific Warren Court decisions. And he, you know, he, he doesn't give consistent answers. Sometimes he says that he, he'll defend these decisions. Sometimes he says he can't talk about them because you know, he's a justice. He can't talk about how the court made its decisions. And the committee also starts asking questions about Fortas's advice to Johnson which again is highly improper. A Supreme Court justice should not be providing political advice to a sitting president. Everyone knew that Fortas was doing it. Fortas says that he can't give this advice because that would be an improper intrusion into the court's uh, freedom of action. And, and the, the three conservative Democrats say that doesn't make any sense. So you're willing to talk to the president, but you're not willing to talk to the Senate. That seems to be not respecting the authority of the, uh, of the Senate. And Fortas, you know, this is always a problem with Fortas and, and LBJ. Fortas thought like a lawyer. He tended to give these very specific legalistic answers that tended to sound very defensive. He was not a particularly good witness.